today we'll see case study based questions of lesson circles let us see the first one a ferry wheel or a big wheel in the united kingdom is an amusement ride consisting of a rotating upright wheel with multiple passenger carrying components commonly referred to as passengers car cabins tubes capsules gondolas or pods attached to the rim in such a way that as the wheel turns they are kept upright usually by gravity after taking a ride in ferry's wheel arti came out from the crowd and was observing her friends who were enjoying the ride she was curious about the different angles and measurements that the wheel will form she forms the figure as given below now look at this one here this one is the ferry's wheel right and at this place her friends are sitting and this is the center of the wheel and arti is standing at this place and from this place she is observing her friends okay so according to this one we have made this figure now let us see which questions they have asked us first one in the given figure find angle roq see r o q that means this angle we need to find out you know first theorem of circles radius is perpendicular to the tangent so at this place this is the radius and this one is the tangent so this angle is 90 degree here o r is the radius and this one is the tangent so this angle is 90 degree right it means that in quadrilateral o q p r in this one these two angles are 90 and 90 correct so some of these two angles will become what 180 right so here you know that sum of all the angles of quadrilateral which is equal to 360 correct that's the reason this two 90 and 90 angles are gone so that means sum of remaining these two angles will become 180 so here one is 30 so from 180 if we remove 30 degree what is left now 150 so therefore measurement of roq is 150 and option c is the correct one look at the second question find angle rqp rqp now look at this one this one is the tangent drawn from the exterior point both the tangents right and they are equal in length therefore this angle and this angle they are equal let us consider them as x and x so here x plus x plus 30 which is equal to what 180 degree correct so 2x which is equal to 150 and x which is equal to 75 so therefore the measurement of angle rqp so this angle is nothing but 75 degree that means option a is correct come to third question find angle rsq rsq this angle so already in the first question we found this angle as 150 right now you imagine here ki okay, central angle is 150 that means this arc this arc is subtending this angle at the center and the same arc is subtending this angle on the remaining part of the circle in ninth standard you have learned angle on the remaining part of the circle is half that of the central angle right which is subtended by the same arc so as this angle is 150 degree so obviously this angle is half of that so which comes as 75 degree so option b is the correct one 75 degree come to the next one find angle orp orp see very simple or is the radius and this rp is the tangent you know first theorem of circles radius is perpendicular to the tangent through the point of contact so this angle is what 90 degree simply option a is the correct one second case study based question Varun has been selected by school to design logo for sports day t-shirt. 
for students and staff. The logo design is as given in the figure and he is working on the fonts and different colors according to the theme. In the given figure, a circle with center O is inscribed in the triangle ABC such that it touches the sides AB, BC and AC at points D, E and F respectively. The lengths of sides AB, BC and CA are 12 cm, 8 cm and 10 cm respectively. Now just look at this one here. The figure is given here. Right? This logo he has to draw on the t-shirts. They have given us the length of sides. So I will just mention there. Length of AB. This AB is given us as 12 cm. Then BC. BC is given as 8 cm. So this one is 8 cm. And AC is given as 10 cm. So this is 10 cm. Now let us see the question. Find the length of AD. This length we need to find out. So let us consider that as X. You know tangents drawn from exterior point to the circle are equal. So AD and AF both the tangents are equal because they are drawn from this point A which is exterior to the circle. So this AD and AF are equal. So I will name them as X. Now as AB is 12, so obviously BD is 12 minus X. And this CF is 10 minus X. Right? Because AC is 10 and this one is X. So 10 minus X. Now this CF and CE, these two are equal. So obviously this one is 10 minus X. And this BD and BE, these are equal. So it is 12 minus X. Now you see BC, this BC which is equal to 8 centimeter already given. But here BC I can write down CE. CE is what? 10 minus X. And BE, that is 12 minus X which is equal to 8. Now we will do the calculation here. So this is 22 minus 2x which is equal to 8. 22 minus 8 which is equal to 2x. This 8 I brought this side and this minus 2x I have sent that side. Okay. So 22 minus 8. If it goes it comes as 14. So 14 which is equal to 2x. So the value of x comes as 14 by 2 is 7 centimeter right and x is nothing but what ad the length of ad is 7 centimeter got it now this one now come to the next question here find the length of be be means this one we need to find out so already we know length of be is what 12 minus x so value of x is 7 so 12 minus 7 it comes as 5 centimeter so option b is the correct one right so b e finally it comes as 5 centimeter third one find the length of c f c f see this one so c f is 10 minus this one is 10 minus x correct so 10 is there minus x means 7 so we get the answer 3. So option D is the correct one. Right? Come to the fourth question. If the radius of the circle is 4 cm. See here. I will just draw the radius which is 4 cm. Radius is 4 cm. This one is 4 cm. Let me just mention it properly. This is 4 cm. Okay. Find the area of triangle OAB. This is the center of the circle. I will just join this one and this one. OAB. Now I need to get the area of this OAB. I know this is the base. And this base we know which is 12 cm. And this one is the altitude which is 4 cm. So area of the triangle which is equal to what? 1 upon 2 
base is 12 and altitude is 4. So, 2 1s are and 2 6 are and 6 4s are 24. So, the area of triangle is 24 centimeter square. Correct? Simple, na? Come to the next one. Now, find the area of triangle ABC. This whole triangle, we need to find out. Just you see here. Okay. Now, this is the center of the circle. I will just join them this way. This way, this is O. Now, you see, this one is the radius and that is altitude also. Because radius is perpendicular to the tangent. Here also, this is the radius and this one is the base. Or you can say tangent. So, radius and tangent, they are perpendicular. This one is radius and tangent BC. Now, we will find out area of triangle AOB. Then BOC and then COA. Correct, na? So, these three parts I made. This is first triangle. Then this one is the second triangle. This one is the third triangle. Correct? So, we will find out area of those triangles. Now, you see here. I will just write down here. Oh, here. 1 upon 2. Area of, I am finding AOB. Base is what? 12. This one is 12. This one is 10. This is 8. So, here 12 into 4 plus area of BOC. 1 upon 2 base is 8 and height is 4. Then I will find out area of AOC. So, here plus 1 upon 2 base is 10 and height is 4. Which is equal to 2 ones are 2 twos are 2 ones are 2 twos are 2 ones are and 2 twos are. 12 twos are 24 plus 8 twos are 16 plus 10 twos are 20. Now see the addition here. If I do the addition 16 and 24 30 40 40 plus 20 is 60. So the answer is 60. Option B is the correct one. Area of triangle ABC is 60 centimeter square.